Hello and welcome to another bonus episode of Hockey Inside Out. We have a question from one of our viewers. Uh, this comes from Rajan. He left it on the Hockey Inside Out YouTube channel, this comment. He said, Cole Caulfield and Nick Suzuki are the best forward duos on the team. Who are two other players you would like to see playing together? So who do you think would be a good fit? Stu, we'll get your thoughts first. I'm going to say Sean Monaghan and Slavkovsky because Slavkovsky has spoken last season about how much he enjoyed playing with him and the veteran presence and able to slow the game down a little bit for him. And I think this is such an important year in Slavkovsky's development. I think it would help having Monaghan with him on the ice and also on the bench. Um, you know, you see the guys with the, the, the iPads on the bench all the time looking at what happens. And Monaghan's almost like another coach there. And I think he would really be able to help Slavkovsky. And they had a little bit of chemistry together when they played – Last season together before Monaghan got hurt. I'm going to go with Doc and Newhook. I really like how those two have played together. I think the speed that Newhook, Newhook brings in that middle gear where it seems like everybody's kind of going at the same speed and he can just take it to the next level is is really impressive and it complements Doc's game along the boards uh, really well in his puck control game. It seems like he's just able to sneak in and through traffic in a way that creates a lot of opportunities to create offense for a really good playmaker like Doc. I'm going to agree with uh, Andrew on that one. Those uh, talk about the duo. I, I, I've been impressed with uh, the chemistry that they formed, uh, you know, so early on in the season. They've got, uh, they've got a great skill set. They've got good, uh, good smarts and the, the ability to make something happen every time they're on the ice. So, um, you know, again, give it some time. Let's see uh, how the uh, progression goes, uh, you know, into the season. But uh, Initially, those guys seem to uh, to gel re- really well together and should make some some big things happen, uh, you know, moving forward. Another duo I think might be interesting would be Gallagher with Harvey Pennard. Uh, Gallagher's you know struggling and and hasn't looked great. Didn't look great in the first game of the season. Uh, the effort level is always there, and you know Marty St. Louis has talked in the past about how Gallagher drags other players into the fight. Him and Harvey Pennard are so similar. I mean, in Laval, Harvey Pennard was called Lavalager. And I think Harvey Pennard might be able to drag Gallagher into the fight a little bit. Not that the work ethic isn't always there, but I think those two guys can feed off each other because they play a very similar style of game. I I think that's a great point, Stu. I wonder if Harvey Pennard, it's not even, like like you said, it's not about work ethic. I wonder if Harvey Pennard's, like, just his pace can bring some fun back to the game for Brandon Gallagher. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's what's missing for him, aside from the injuries obviously being a factor. It just looks like he's not having fun out there. And Harvey Pernard came up, I've talked about this, he, he idolized Brendan Gallagher. He modeled his game after Brendan Gallagher. So imagine you're a kid, you're looking up to this guy, and now all of a sudden you're playing not only on the same team, but on the same line as him. I think that'll give him an extra boost too. So I think I think those two guys can feed off each other. And I think Gallagher at this point, with all the injuries he's gone through and all the frustration, I think he needs that little bump that he's always been able to provide to his teammates. I think now it's time that maybe he needs that a little bit from another teammate. So do you agree with our panelists or do you have any other duos you have in mind? Leave that in the comments section below. And if you have anything we would le- you would like us to talk about, leave that in the comments as well. And we'll get to it hopefully at some point this season. And if you want to check out the full episode, you know where to go. Go to HockeyInsideOut.com and check out that episode.